Hey, what's up guys? Uh, thanks for tuning in. Uh, today I have an unboxing of the Gunners Lightning Bolt 360. I just got that in the mail, so let's get into the video. So I've been wearing Gunners uh, for a while now, for a couple of years, and the first one I bought, uh, the name was Halogen. Uh, currently I own the FPS. This is a collaboration with Razer. And the reason I kept this one is because of the lower profile on the arms. So if you're wearing headphones, it's not going to get uncomfortable. Previously, I have the RPGs, but the problem with those is that the arms are too thick. So when you put your headphones on, you get tired very quickly. So I really like the profile of the RPGs, but again, the problem was the arm. So with this one, you don't have that problem at all. So with the lightning bolt, uh, this one comes with three sets of arms. So you're going to be able to swap out depending on, on your needs. And there is one designed specifically for headphones. So when you put it on, it's not going to get uncomfortable. So you can buy the lightning bolt uh, by themselves. And the 360 basically, they come with uh, sunglasses. So they have both indoors and outdoor usage. This is the box right here. And nothing else. Just a uh, gunner card. So you can change the lenses, that's a pretty cool thing. Uh, this one headset compatible, and I think, again, like I was saying, it's the lower profile here. So let's see what's in the box. Also, right off the bat here, you can see you have your sun lenses and just your regular amber lenses. Some people don't like this amber coating because it, it makes, I guess, the colors pop and sometimes sometimes it's unrealistic. I mean, I, I really like uh, the way uh, it enhances the visuals on, on, on the games or even when you're watching movies. Uh, but like I said, some people may not like this. I think they do have an option where it doesn't have the, the amber coating on it. It's just uh, clear. And you know, also you get some nose bridge uh, sizes over here. And you get these three options. So let's open it up. in a nice case this is really nice uh, the previous ones I had they, they only come in the box and they have like a pouch but uh, this is the first time I've seen it coming in a um, hard sh shell case Let's see what's inside okay so we have uh, some a pamphlet here is a uh, an example of what I was saying, you can get the, the tint clear if you don't like the amber one. And these ones are the new ones for the sunglasses. And the Ember Max, which I've never I've never used before. So we've got also some uh, device lens wipes. And these are just instructions. And this one is a cleaning cloth. Okay, and over here we have... These ones are the sun lenses. You can swap those if you're going to use it out, outside. And here we have the strap. So basically this one, you can attach this one. I guess if, you, if you're going out, maybe if you're uh, on your bicycle or you're doing any, um, any activities, running or stuff like that. So this strap is gonna make sure that it stays in place. So. This is the pouch I was telling you about. It used to be that you only get the pouch and you can use it to clean your lenses as well. So it's pretty nice that they uh, included this hard shell. And here are the glasses. It's quite similar to the profile of the RPGs I had before. And like I was saying, 
my issue with those is was this was too thick when you were uh, wearing uh, headphones. I mean, if you compare it with the FPS, it's, it's a big difference. But the good thing is that you get other options like this one right here. This one definitely, if we look at the profile over here, it's a lot thinner, similar to these ones. So that's gonna help to, uh, that's gonna help the, sun, the glasses to feel comfortable for long periods of time. Let's see. To swap it out, they just come out like that. You just push here. Pretty easy to swap out. Pretty nice. I think this is the one I'm gonna be wearing. nice looking ones so that's pretty much everything you get in the kit like i was saying these are some uh, nose bridge that you can swap out if you need if you need a different size so. all right guys so to recap this is everything that you're gonna get uh, with the kit you're gonna get your instructions over here, your pamphlet with some information. Uh, you get your wipes, your uh, pouch over here. You get your three sets of um, temples slash arms, the main glasses, of course. Uh, you also get your hard shell case, the lenses for the sunglasses, uh, your three sets of uh, nose bridges, so small, medium, and large. You got your cleaning cloth, so that's you're gonna get in one package. All right, guys, so here are the glasses on. Like I say, I decided to go with a lower profile over here. No, and the reason why is if you look at this wedge right here, that's gonna help. Um, keep your headphones uh, comfortable for long periods of time. When you put it on, the headphones rest right there on the wedge. So it's not gonna be uh, causing any extra pressure, which is the problem I have with the previous RPGs, which has the same design over here, but the legs are pretty much the same as the ones that uh, these ones come out of the box. So. Uh, this lower profile is definitely going to help out with those uh, long sessions when you're playing or if you're just watching movies and stuff like that. So, that's a, it's a pretty nice design. If you need to change the nose bridge, it's not too hard. All you do is just squeeze over here. Right? Once you have, have it like that, you're going to press down. Like there's one leg out there, press the other one. And you just replace it. Right now I'm wearing the large ones, so that's the one I'm gonna keep. And if you need to change it, if you if you wanna go with the option of the wearing the, the sun lenses, uh, all you do is you, you're gonna squeeze over here, right? So it's not too hard to replace. I'm gonna be keeping uh, these ones like this. So, so anyway, guys, uh, thanks a lot for uh, joining me today. If you have any questions, any comments, uh, leave them down below. If you wanna join me on Twitch? Uh, I'm gonna leave the link in the description. Uh, stay safe out there, and I'll catch you on the next one.